So we're up in Williams today off of Route 66. We're going to be taking the Bill Williams Mountain Trail. Uh, we're going to try to get all the way to the top. We'll find out what happens. No, well, I'm not. You ready to go? Mm -hmm. Okay, let's go. Yeah. You don't look like you're moving that fast in the video. Look at me. Can I have my hat back? Fine. All right, yeah, we're doing break number one. We had a little bit of a meltdown a little bit ago because he was complaining his feet hurt, his legs hurt, his pack was too heavy, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Well, he didn't want to hike, that. he didn't want to do this. And we had only gone like a tenth of a mile. So we uh, we got things straightened out now. Hopefully the rest of the hike will be be much better. He's got his favorite treat. So we'll get some sugar in him and some water and see how that goes for the rest of the trip. So you'll notice the little guy's wearing a little different outfit. He got cold, so we put on his jacket and traded out his shorts for some pants. So he's a little more comfortable. Everything's gotten a little bit better, but just to reinforce the lesson that you need to need to bring layers, especially for the kids. Yeah, I can see where they've been maybe been logging. They took the tree out. Oh. Took the tree out, loaded it onto a truck, and took it away. And why are these trees still here? Well, that tree fell naturally. It's not useful to the loggers. They take the trees that they cut down because those are trees that they can use in the logging mill to make boards. Yeah, for buildings and all kinds of other things. All right, we got break number two here. And Mama's gonna have a break too. Well, I'm gonna take a little water break. If you listen closely, once the wind dies down, you can hear the, uh, the sounds from the logging operation in the background. Got a huge area they're clearing out. We're walking right along beside it. Does that taste good, buddy? Just a little hint, red vines taste better when you're hiking. Just like peanut butter and honey sandwiches taste better when you're hiking too. My favorite. I know, there's all these big clouds, but no rain. There's no rain today. 
No, no, it's not gonna rain. No. Well, there's a big giant dark cloud behind you. I'm sure there is. Doesn't mean it's gonna rain. Oh. Hey guys, I'm so tired. I love you too, buddy. Oh. I love you too. You're the best mom ever. Well, thank you. Alright, so we're just chilling out. Did you start it? Jack, yes. Back up. You're too close. So we're just chilling out here listening to all the different bird sounds. See if you can hear it too. <laughs> that sounded like an argument. Oh, what's that? Sounded like a squirrel bird. That's squirrel what it should bird. be called. Let's see if we can hear that woodpecker again. Woodpecker. It smells like there's a skunk in the area, so I think maybe we'll turn around and get out of here. Okay. It's getting pretty ripe. Let's go. Let's go. <gasps> but it's real nice to hear all those birds, huh? Probably the worst part of the whole trail. This trail's not too bad though. It's not too bad at all. Pretty good. Pretty easy. Hello. There's Jack. So hi, we made it. Uh, we finished another hike. Well, we didn't get all the way to the top, but we did finish a hike. Um, I've had to change the way we do hikes, but that's okay. We're getting hikes in. We're doing. We're having fun, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. This was an interesting hike today. So we're up at Bill Williams Mountain Trail. Um, they have a huge logging area where they're clearing out a bunch of trees and dead wood and all kinds of other stuff. So, oh God. Uh, so, so we were going right along the edge of one of the, the logging areas. And uh, it was interesting to see them clearing, you know, so we didn't get to actually see them. We could hear them, but it was actually interesting to see the, um, the areas that had been trimmed back and cut up and, and stuff like that and what else did we do oh we saw some trail runners today that was fun there he is. that's not the trail runner that's that's one of the guys that, that mm -hmm. hiked up and i guess he only did a mile he hiked up and hiked back anyway so so we, so we saw a couple of trail runners today with the dog that was kind of fun and interesting it scared us we heard the collar jingling on the dog and i turned around and there's these two trail runners right behind me i was like whoa hello no i um, heard it um, we're trying to do some geocaches. We might get to do one. I'm ready. But hold on, we uh, oh, come on. The, we we suspect where the geocache is. Um, oh, stop. Is where the people are picnicking, and they have a glass yeah. of wine. I don't think they're leaving anytime yeah. soon. Are they leaving? Oh, maybe we can go get that geocache real quick before we leave. Okay. Oh, my favorite well, I don't know, it was a, it was kind of a nice hike today favorite part. it was it was in the in the high 60s uh not too bad of a trail a little bit of um switchbacks and rock scrambling but it was nice part. lots of nice little areas and stuff and it was really fun you know what my favorite part was what <coughs> my favorite part was stopping and listening to all the birds Why that you? was so cool yeah, that helicopter. So anyway, okay, lots of different birds. Part. What was your favorite part? The dogs. Of course it was the dogs. So we saw... Much dust on here. Yeah, so right towards the beginning, we saw two hikers coming up back with, and they both each had a dog. Mm. And then there was the trail runners, and they had a dog. So yeah, we got to see a few dogs today. That was kind of nice, but yeah. overall, it was a really fairly quiet trail. Um, even the logging... The noise from the logging um, operation wasn't that loud. It was it was really kind of nice. Um, we did end up turning around because he was getting a little tired. It was getting a little late. We came up along our time frame, but um, but uh, there was a skunk in the area, and he might have been scared by one of the dogs or something on the trail. I don't know, but it smelled so skunky. So we turned around and got out of there. We were like, oh. That was one of my favorite parts too. Oh. <laughs> the skunk. Ew, P.U. Skunk. <laughs> um, we'll be back in Williams next week. Um, I think that's all we have for today. Ready to say goodbye? Wait, what? Bye!
Bye-bye. Bye. Bye.